According to the director of the Institute of Statistical, Social and Economic Research, Professor Peter Quarte, the government's high election-related expenditure led to the nation to return to the IMF for an economic bailout. If you look at capital expenditure for 2020 compared to the previous years, you can clearly see that we were investing in projects during election years. Presidents cut, in fact, that's the pure, they cut sword. They move like spaghetti, go here, go and cut sword, then come here, come and cut sword. They, you know, I, I, you see them, they start, you know, moving with the motor kit. If you and I were in the, in the shoes of government, we would have done the same thing. It's a winner takes all. Our constitution is such that it is winner takes all. When I become president, I appoint so many people. You know, when you are in government, it's like you take all. You take all the decisions. You manage everything. And when you are out, you are out completely. When you are in government, people carry your bag everywhere you go. When you are out, you carry your suitcase, you carry your bag. So when you are there, you don't want to leave power. But the rules have to. It's human. Human beings are such that when they are in a certain position, they want to remain forever. So nature calls them, God calls them. But when there are rules of engagement, then it corrects some of this problem. So we've had this issue of political business cycle where during elections we spend like there's no tomorrow. Then we come back and spend the next three years to clean up. And that is one of the reasons why